80 new products launching. My name is Tina Nguyen, the founder of XXL Scrunchie, and we hand make XXL Scrunchies Mini and XXS Scrunchies. We also have other hair accessories too. Welcome to the virtual XXL Scrunchie market. Except you can't buy stuff right now because I'm just showing you what's gonna be available because there's gonna be a. Good morning! I'm having leftover pizza for breakfast and this plate looks dirty because I had I had two pieces thinking that was enough and I was like no I want to eat the rest I'm sitting beside this I don't even know what it is wine I think or champagne I don't know but Jeff got a hot tub like a free hot tub and the people that gave him the hot tub gave him this bottle so we could enjoy our first night in the hot tub like how nice is that people are so nice I can't. my new favorite mug okay I'm gonna Finish eating my pizza, wash my face. Today, I want to be a radiant tomato for you guys. And then set up the area to show you guys the 80 new products launching. Summer forever, yeah. Does anyone else come into the bathroom? The toothpaste cap is always off because I do. Do you guys, do you put the toothpaste on and then wet your toothbrush? Or do you wet the toothbrush and then put the toothpaste on? Does anyone else have the worst allergies right now? Because I do and I apologize in advance for any gross nose sniffles that I forget to edit out. <laughs> Today, I want to be a radiant tomato for you guys. I have no nails, I can't open it. Yeah. Okay, radiant tomato vibes coming right up for you guys. Now I gotta make the bed. Okay, now I just gotta wait like, I don't know, 10 minutes to, for this mask to dry up and then I'll take it off. I shed so much hair that I have a Swiffer in my room, in the closet, just so I can always Swiffer after I comb or brush my hair. The mask is finally dry now. I would like to thank Ritual for sponsoring today's video. Did you know that the top five best-selling gut supplements from the top five brands do not include a postbiotic? Exciting news, Ritual is expanding their products and recently launched Symbiotic Plus, a daily three-in-one with clinically studied prebiotic, probiotic, and postbiotic supplement. What are those biotics? Prebiotics support the growth and activity of beneficial bacteria living in the gut. Probiotics are living microorganisms and are included to relieve bloating and gas. The postbiotic provides fuel to cells that make up the gut lining and supports gut barrier function. That's why the Symbiotic Plus is more than a probiotic. One daily capsule essence with mint. Designed with delayed release technology to help reach your colon, not your stomach. Ritual is a brand I trust because of the transparency with what they use from where they source their nutrient and their environmental impact. Their science based and research stacked, showing you every labeled ingredient, supplier, and key studies that go into their vegan-friendly products. Subscription delivered to your door every month with free shipping. The Symbiotic Plus and Ritual are here to celebrate, not hide, your insides. There's no more shame in your gut game. That's why Ritual is offering you all 20% off your first month using my code SCRUNCHY20. That's 20% off your first month by going to ritual.com slash scrunchy20 and using my code scrunchy20 at checkout. I even got Jeff the ritual essential for men. Thank you ritual for sponsoring this video. Let's get back to the scrunchy launch but first gotta hydrate. The 
just as a friendly reminder to have a sip of water today. The mask is finally dry enough, I can take it off. Like a newborn. And then I always do this, which I think it says on the back, you dab the excess liquids onto your face because you want to make the most of your mask. But guys, as I'm setting up, I get a text from Tatum, who's currently packing at the warehouse right now. A bunch of orders waiting to get out from the weekend. Our printing thing gets rejected. It says rejected by SLM monitor, so it means we can't process the shipping label itself. Yeah. I feel like nine times out of ten when I'm out of the office, something kind of comes up or something happens and it's like, Tina, you should be here working right now. Sorry that these will not be in the launch. I'm sorry. But I'm putting these on here so we can talk about it later. So keep watching. Oh. products and they're all right here in front of me. Woo! This is gonna be our biggest launch ever and all these products will be available on June 28th at 12 p.m. EST. Half of these products are limited edition, meaning once they sell out, we can't make them again because we bought all the fabric that was available at Fabricland and for that specific pattern and we won't be able to make more because they're sold out of that. Sorry. We're just having some shipping issues right now at the warehouse. For some reason, our labels won't print that we have to attach onto the box and ship out. So hopefully that gets solved. And of course, it happens today on my virtual market day. I think the only other launch that has matched up to this was probably 60 or 40 products before. We've been working on some of these since it's June right now. We've been working on some of them since November. We've had photo shoots in Mexico. We've had photo shoots in my basement. We've had photo shoots at Studio Fig in Picton. We've had, oh, another photo shoot part of this launch right here in my kitchen and I guess a fifth one at the Wander Resort. So we've had so many products that we've had to have multiple shoots, but I think it would be worth it because, um, I don't know why because, just because. <laughs> I just love everything in this launch and I think that you guys will too. The other day I was actually done editing and then I found like, how many scrunchies did I find? I, I found six other scrunchies I forgot about. So what happened? I had to recount everything and then I thought we had 60 products and then when I recounted, we actually have 80 new products. And some of them aren't even made yet. So I'm gonna be elasticing some and explaining all the names and some of them aren't named yet either. So we're gonna name them together on today's vlog. Let's start off with the swim scrunchies. Did you guys know that we have swim scrunchies? And by swim scrunchies, I mean scrunchies made of bathing suit material that can get wet. Right now we have swim scrunchies in mini oh don't mind me i'm just gonna elastic these so i can show off the colors of the so you guys can see the entire swim scrunchie this is a scrunchie tube and then this is elastic and this is a bodkin we have swim scrunchies in size mini which is the beige one at the top of my braid and we have swim scrunchies in size xxl we have swim scrunchies right now on our site xxl and mini and in this launch there will be 15 new swim xxs scrunchies just give me a sec and I'll show you the size. Our Swim XXS scrunchies are meant to get wet. They're meant to wear to the beach, to the pool. You can wear them every day, but they are quick dry. Just like your bathing suit, they are made of bathing suit material, 80% nylon and 20% spandex. And the colors are just so bright, perfect for summer. 
or your vacations. I recently went to a TikTok market. I was a vendor, one of five or one of six small businesses that were there and a bunch of guys went up to me and they're like, me and my wife are going to Italy this summer. Like so many couples going to Italy this summer. I wish it was me. Which one would she like? And I immediately grabbed the swim scrunchie and I'm like, give her or get her this. Tell her it's made of bathing suit material. It's meant to get wet. It's a swim scrunchie. She will die. Imagine your husband came home and was like, hey babe, got you a swim scrunchie for summer vacation to Italy. I'd be like, how did you even think of that? But yeah, that was a really fun moment. So this is the XXS size. This is in the Tay. And then you can see here the size comparison better. And then I'll go show you guys pictures of what it looks like in the hair. So you know, but how cute. I'm so excited. Our swim collection we have 15 different colors so we will be launching 15 new swim xxs scrunchies this one's the tay named tay who i was just calling and this is the fay which i have an elastic yet so i want to do it just so you can see all the products that we'll be launching we're still in the midst of making them that's why i don't have it just pre-made yet we have them all sewn we just don't have them all elastic or seamed. And by seam, I mean when you sew the last hole of the scrunchie. So excited. The story behind Swim XXS. We've always, oh my God. Do you ever get so excited to talk about stuff and then you like stumble over your own words? I just literally did that. The story behind Swim XXS, um, we've always wanted to do it, but we have to use a serger machine. A serger gives like four stitches and it's a lot thicker. Like the inside of your clothes are probably serged. And serging scrunchies that small is it's hard it's harder than doing an xxl because you have more room with xxs you have such little room for error and you have it's a lot slower to make them because you can't just sew as fast you have to take breaks and make sure everything aligns when an xxl it's easier to guide because there's more fabric with that being said we've kind of avoided swim xxs until i was about to go on vacation with my cousin for her wedding for anlan and anlan's who i made the first she's my cousin who i made the first xxl scrunchie for, and she's the one who told me to start as a business. Shout out Ann Lan. Whew. Anyways, I was literally, it was the day before I was about to fly out to her wedding and my friend Kalina messaged me, please make swim XXS scrunchies. I love your mini swim scrunchies. And in my mind, I was like, okay, we need to make them because I'm going to Mexico tomorrow. Um, I reached out to the photographer, the wedding photographer, Dave, that was gonna be there. And he said he would make time to do a shoot with me. We we're gonna be there for seven days. So we had a bit of time, except we didn't have any of these made yet. We didn't know what what sizes so me Courtney and my mom quickly made like four swim XXS scrunchies to decide which size what width what length we wanted and then we finally uh, came across uh, I don't remember what I was saying the battery died even though it's plugged in um, we did the shoot in Mexico with Dave I wanted two of each scrunchie so I could have one to actually wear on the beach and stuff and have one set aside properly for the photo shoot so we had to make 30 scrunchies before I left that day of each color like we had to cut them sew them, elastic them, all of that within the day before I left for Mexico. <laughs> so last minute, but I was like, Mexico will be the perfect opportunity to have the shots. And look at how some of the photos turned out. Never shot with Dave before. He shoots in a different style, like more edgy, which I really enjoyed because it gives us a little bit of a different vibe for our new Swim XXS scrunchies. That's the story behind it. Um, I've actually had many comments and emails also asking like, can you make Swim XXS? And when it's in an email it's just easy to be like nah like we're busy doing other stuff we have plans but then when my friend Kalina texted me the day before I was going to Mexico I was like okay gotta do this just do it it'll be worth it and totally worth it they're so cute and I'm so excited so they come in all of these not all of these colors but I'll show you guys the colors these are satin XXS that we'll be launching. I'll talk about in a sec. But our swim come in all of these colors that you saw me put on the thing. So the tawn, which is black, tor, brown. Anlan, named after Anlan, is gray. If you guys have got our swim scrunchies before, they're the same colors, just in XXS size. But for some of you that are new here, I'm just explaining them. White, named Trang, after my cousin. Purple, named Kaz. Actually named after someone off Love Island. See, guys, I love Love Island. The navy swim, named Koi 
after my cousin. Blue, Sally, after someone on Love Island. Pink, Millie. It's actually named after someone I know and after someone on Love Island. So two people, one name, one scrunchie. This is the Tao in red after my cousin. Orange for Erica after someone who convinced me, not just me, but she posted on her story, like you should get TikTok. And she's the reason I got TikTok, this girl, Erica. Molly, yellow after uh, Molly May in Love Island. This one's named Faye after a customer name plus a Love Island name. And this one is named after Tay who is on the XXL team. Oh, and this one is named Matea. Uh, do you guys know, if you guys watch way back how I found my first warehouse through my realtor, Joe, and my first house, this is named after his daughter, Matea, the green one. All right, swim. 15 scrunchies checked. You're probably like, that's a lot already. Like we haven't even gone started. We're not even halfway through. So swim, put it there. Can you see it still? Next, we have, we've been slowly adding in XXS from our satin. And if you guys know, we have the Alice. It will be now available in XXS satin. We have the Mads, one of our most popular colors. I'm thinking of making this into a pillowcase. How cute would a blue, cornstarch blue satin pillowcase be? So the Mads XXS will be launching. The Lindsay XXS, it's silver satin. Sterling XXS, it's a like darker gray satin. These are two limited editions. So I gotta show you guys a bit closer. This has little palm trees on it. I'm thinking of just calling it palm. I'm not sure. I have a big list of customer names as well. So I might name it after customer. Limited edition. So when this one goes out, it won't be available. And this one's like a chiffon. It's not satin, but it's like a soft, I don't know, matte satin. This will be limited edition as well. In the launch, I'm excited. So I will add these onto the XXS scrunchie tower over here. Oops. Now what? I think we should talk about the florals that are gonna launch. All right, let's get to the limited edition florals. The ones that are named so far are these ones that you guys picked and helped me suggest the names. This one, I believe, let me check. There's so many names, I don't know them all yet. Well, I thought I knew this name and I didn't write it down. What? So actually this purple one, limited edition. All the florals you see today are limited edition. When they're gone, they're gonna be gone. So don't sleep on it. This one is called Lila. Someone suggested this because of the Guardians of the Galaxy name. How cute is this one? One of my favorites made of like a chiffon -y, purpley, soft, light fabric. You guys love these fabrics every time we get them. Yeah. And I'll show you guys some photos from the shoot with Cassandra I did of them, me and them in my basement. Lila, oh, I forgot this one is gonna be called Mary Lou. Someone suggested it as well. And yes, there is an XXS of it. Mary Lou. I guess I haven't named this one yet either or any of those ones. So let's name them together, shall we? How cute is this Mary Lou in all three of the sizes? Lila, all three of the sizes. Next up, let's find a name for this cute fabric. I love this one. Little green florals, XXL, mini, and the XXS. Here's a shot of me elasticing it. And for the names, let me go check those Instagram comments because you guys have really good comment suggestions for these names. <gasps> Sybil, my beautiful granddaughter. Love that. And this is one of my really, really good friend's moms. So this is her niece name actually. So let's do that, Sybil. Crabby aunt, thank you so much, Helen. Uh, this one. Ooh, this girl, V Das Budget is her handle. And she wanted to name these after her sister, Venari. Vanari is a hardworking mom with a toddler. Oh, that's so cute. Vanari. This one is now called the Vanari. Love it. I'm seeing lots of autumns as name suggestions. Aw, Tian, Tiani by KK Cosmetics would like to suggest the name Felicity because it's her aunt's name, Felicity. And her aunt's favorite color is green. She loves green. There we go. Hope she likes it. I think it so suits Felicity. Okay, next up are these. These scrunchies are all made of organic cotton, which means it's more like, can you hear the noise? It's soft. Like if you have cotton pillowcases, this is probably what it's made out of, but 
they're made of organic cotton, which is, um, I'll explain why here. <laughs> I forget the terms. But there's so many fun colors and they're very soft and I think perfect for summer. None of these are named yet, so we'll be naming them right now. And after all these, we'll be sharing the hair claw name. Which one should we start with? I wanna start with this pink rosy color. So that will be this, this, and the mini, of course. How nice, right? So we'll put them right here. What should we name this scrunchie? Let's just put them up here, actually. I'll take all these off, and then the feature scrunchie can be on here so you guys can see it better and know what to name it. This is fun, right? Okay, what do we want to name this scrunchie? Oh my gosh, we got an order! I wish the sound was on so you guys could hear the ching. I'll just play it here. <gasps> Lori from Texas. This is her first order. She got a enamel pin. She got the Anlan tee, this sweater, but a t-shirt. And she got the mystery five pack in the assorted size. Thank you, Lori, for her first order. It means so much. Like every order means so much, but when someone orders a lot on their first order, it's like, wow, you're really trusting us. And I feel so honored. Back to the name. Hmm. Ooh, Ayu in Japanese. It means beautiful. I am vibing with that. This is gonna be Ayu. I think she named it after herself, but that's nice. Gotta make sure I save the username because I wanna give these people credit for their suggestions. All right, this one is named Ayu. Hope I'm saying it right. I think it suits the vibe. What do you guys think? All named, almost named. We just have a couple more and then we're gonna get to the long awaited hair claw clips. Next, let's do this very colorful one because I have no clue what to name it. How pretty is it? This thing is missing a leg. That's why it's so like gonna fall. All right, let's name this scrunchie. Let's name it. Let's go. Lots of garden. Kimmy. <laughs> Lots of Reese, but we already have a Reese scrunchie or else I would have loved to have a Reese. Lots of gardenia. Paola. Let's call this one Paola. I love that. Paola, Paola by Paola Guinera. Thanks for your suggestion, Paola. Hel say hello to Paola. This scrunchie, I actually wish I had markers because you can actually color in on this fabric. Like how cool is that? So if you have fabric coloring markers, feel free to color in on the scrunchie. Okay, stay please, we just have a couple left. Hey, what do we want to name this scrunchie? Nikki, Grace, Sonia, Derry, Tinker, Lucy, Ava, Miriam, Betty for my mom. <gasps> Two-time cancer winner, first cancer was pancreatic cancer. Then the most recently breast cancer, single immigrant mom raising three kids and makes the best kimchi. Every child is obligated to say that about their immediate kimchi making family members. But I say it with full support and belief in my obligation. She speaks English, Korean, Spanish, and Portuguese, and her English is awesome. And she loves to do gardening in her typical countryside floral pants with big straw hats. She checks off all the boxes of an ajuma with some spice and pizzazz. I love my mom. What? That is so cute. Oh, Tatum just texted that. The orders are ready to pick up, so false alarm. Tatum got it under control. Mm, I would love Betty. This could be a cute Betty because like you could color it in. It could be any kind of color. Let's do Betty for this. Betty! Props to you, Betty. You're a fighter. I love that. Call it Betty. Thanks, um, Starberry221 for suggesting and sharing the story about your mom. Wow. Next up is this really cute green. It has florals on it. Can you see? There you go. And yes, there's an XXS, but I don't have a third hand. I'm just gonna put it there. Can you see that? Haven, it means safe place. When I think of your videos or scrunchies, I'm in a safe place by Haven McKay. I love that. Aww. <laughs> you guys are killing it with the names. This is way more fun for me. Let's do, ooh, I love this one. Do that about all of them, but I don't care. It's my product, I can love them all if I want to. This one, how do, how do you not love this one? Here we go. What do we want to name this? Kalissa, that's a cute name. Kalissa's cool. My daughter's name, Kitana, or my little cousin's name is Willow. Let's do Kitana. That's a very cute name after your little cousin, Kitana. Thank you, Ashley Robinson Illustrates. I should have screenshot all these, but it's too late. There's too much going on, too excited. Okay, we got two names left. This is just navy with pops of floral, and I'm here for it this summer. Here for it. I'm getting the hang of this thing now. My bestie's name, Angela, and I think it works so well with those floral colors. I think this could be an Angela. Yeah. Last one, guys. 
One of my favorites. <laughs> Aren't they all? But seriously, this one, this rose, so nice. I don't even think, I forgot to even take pictures of these, so I had to quickly take pictures at home. So these scrunchies weren't part of the shoot with Cassandra, which I'm sad, but so cute. Like, it's so pretty. Okay, well, we won't name it. My daughter getting ready for school just yelled downstairs, mom, use a scrunchie this morning because I used a hair tie and she was struggling to take it out. So fate, question mark, LOL, she'd love to, she'd love this one because she always stops and smells the flowers. Also probably biased, but I truly believe she's one out of one. Limited edition, so I may be suggesting it after her. Luciana, let's go, Luciana. Thank you, Melissa Gets Free 2019. Woo! I love that story. Every scrunchie has a story. Now we're done with the names. That was fun. <laughs> Let's reveal the hair collage. The hair collage. Like, how? This is so much. Ah! This is 36 scrunchies in here. And then I think there's like 15, but like 20 ish on here. <laughs> And now we get to do the hair claws. So the hair claws, I made these videos of myself trying on every single hair claw. I asked you guys for the suggestions of every single hair claw. And there's nine. There's also an XXS hair claw. They're much tinier. They'll be in white, black, and tortoise. I just don't have them here because we're getting them um, tagged. Like we're putting the tags on them to get them ready to sell. So I didn't get to bring any home. <laughs> Sorry about that, but... We got all our other ones. Like, look at them all. They're so pretty. I did a whole shoot with them with Cassandra, literally on the ground right here in my kitchen. So let's go through the names together. So this yellow hair cloth. How pretty is it? We're gonna be calling it Lemon Drop. Sangria. Sandy. Sparkling Rosé. Like, come on, Sparkling Rosé. Oceana, after our lovely Oceana friend. Lavender Prosecco. I actually named this one inspired by all of your guys' names with these summer beverages because hello, they are like such summer beverages. Lavender Prosecco. Never had that drink, but I want to. This one's gonna be called Fairy Floss. I think in UK or Australia, that's what they call cotton candy. Someone commented that, I forget. It's in my notes though, so don't worry. I named this one too, I think, but inspired by someone's idea. Watermelon Sangria. And so many people wanted this one to be called Wildflower, and I love it. This is one of my favorite clips ever. And it has a matching hair comb. Ah! Matching hair comb. I think that's all of them. Yeah, the only one I didn't get to is the XXS hair claws. But yeah, I'm excited. Woohoo! Lemon drop, sangria, sandy, sparkling rose, oceana. Lavender Prosecco, Fairy Floss, Watermelon Sangria, and Wildflower with the matching comb. Ta-da! This is what the post looks like that I designed and it has the, the names in there. So excited. Okay guys. <laughs> Sorry, I got cut off. These scrunchies and more, so 80 products total. These scrunchies and our new hair claw clips will be launching just a week and a day from today on Wednesday, June 28th at 12 p.m. EST. Get ready for the biggest launch ever. Limited editions, swims, florals, hair claw clips, everything you guys love, everything I love. We've been working on it. For a long time, all of our scrunchies are handmade. We cut them all, all the fabric, sew it all, hand tie it all. I'm out of breath, why? I'm just so excited. Thank you for being here again. My name's Tina and let me know if you have any other questions in the comments. I'll be monitoring them to make sure you guys are up to date. For our launch, I wanna make sure everyone is prepared because I, we don't have too many of the limited edition ones. We have just like, we have a good chunk, but 
I want to make sure whoever really wants them knows the time, knows the launch, and can get the ones that they like. See you next week at the launch! And we got these new little tote bags. They, these are just samples, so I want to see what you guys think. Some people think we should get a longer strap so it could be a crossbody and keep the little strap. But how cute is this? It has a little square bottom, literally good lunch bag, and it has pockets on the inside, little button at the top. This is the regular tote bag. And then this is the XXS potential tote bag. I think it's so cute and like the size. If you guys like them, let me know. This is just a sneak peek, just a sample because I'm being really careful with what we order to make sure they're more perfect before I order a bunch because I've had issues before. So let me know, help me out. What do you guys think? Do you like the XXS tote bags? I know you guys like the regular, so. I actually have to turn off this humidifier thing downstairs. Fan on. So many fans! How do I turn it off? It's a big fan. There's another fan? Oh. Um, when Jeff turned the water back on to fill our new hot tub, this pipe burst, and then he said water was just shooting. And then by the time he came downstairs, he happened to come downstairs within like 10 minutes of turning that on. The whole floor was like filled with water. Like how scary is that? And I was at work and he called me, but luckily that corner was just empty. So we could not have been luckier to have that happen in that way and for him to catch it. So good job, Jeff. And then I will turn that back on after the vlog.